Hello, and welcome to another video from Centurion Graphics. Today, we are going to be talking about the difference between vector artwork and bitmaps. There are many different ways of creating artwork, with hundreds of different graphic design programs available, and depending on which program you use will affect whether your artwork is a vector or a bitmap. So, the aim of our tutorial today is to help you understand whether your artwork is a vector or a bitmap. And if it is, what you need to make sure that it is ready to be made into a printing plate. So let's get straight into it. Here we've got an example of the difference between vectors and bitmaps. Now, from afar, these all look the exact same. But upon closer inspection, you'll see that they are very different. So first, let's look at the vector. So if we zoom in here, we can see... The vector is very smooth and if we use this as artwork for a printing plate then this is exactly how smooth your printing plate will look with the, all these smooth edges and it will leave a perfect impression of your artwork. Next let's have a look at our normal bitmap. When we zoom into this artwork we can see that it is very pixelated and it's made up of different coloured pixels. Now I'm sure you'd agree that this isn't as high quality as our vector shown earlier. Now when making printing plates, any coloured artwork that isn't black or white will come out as a series of small dots raised on the plate and these are called screens or tints. So if we used this artwork to make a printing plate, then the plate would show all of these pixels and it would show, show up as different tints on the plate and this would not leave a good impression for you especially if you're wanting a solid print so finally let's have a look at our black and white bitmap now when we zoom in we can see that it's still made up of pixels however there are all the pixels that are here are black there's no coloured pixels it's black and white. Now, you can see that it's not quite as high quality as our smooth vector artwork. But if we use this to make a printing plate, the, the artwork here would be raised perfectly on the plate and would leave a, a good solid print, even if it was slightly pixelated. But we would be happy with this. So, to conclude, if you want the highest quality print possible, we would recommend using vectors. However, if this isn't possible and you're only able to use a bitmap, then we would recommend converting this bitmap into a black and white bitmap. And if, if this is something that you're unable to do, then please contact us and we're happy to try and help you through this. I hope this video has helped you understand the difference between vectors and bitmaps. If you have any other questions, then please feel free to contact us. Please also subscribe to make sure that you don't miss out on any other artwork tutorials.